So we're inside the Venetian and basically what we're gonna do is we're just gonna see how many people are wearing a mask or not wearing a mask. So that's our goal today and we're gonna be um, kind of showing a little bit of Venetian while we do it. And uh, it's about mid, I have the date in the lower corner, but it's middle of May now. Let's take a look, how many people are wearing masks? Hey, check it out Macau 2023. Check out some more streets. Okay, so obviously those two. Um, let's say it's about, we'll, we'll kind of see. So we're basically going to see how many people are wearing masks. Let's go this way. I think there's a little bit more people this way. So those ones are not. Yes, there. So I think that my, my guess right now is about 60% um, are not wearing. There's a gondola. So just to kind of give you a little bit of idea, we're in the Venetian right now. And we're just going to kind of walk around and take a look and see. It's about 50-50 for a mask, I think. Here's four with a mask, an entire group. Um, basically, we had to wear a mask for three years. It was kind of, um, in Hong Kong, it was required. You had to, they, they charge you um, $5,000, 5, Hong Kong dollar fine, which is about 550 American dollars if you didn't wear a mask. And then in Macau, everybody wore a mask and you were required to wear it. You couldn't get in a bus or go into, walk around in public. I mean, in um, these kind of places. In public, there was no rule, but when they had a lockdown, they would actually, they actually put some people in jail because they didn't, didn't wear a mask when you had a five, five month sentence. I kind of wonder what happened to that. Um, okay. Let's take a look at the mask up there. Okay, so now we're kind of, um, kind of got some people, there's, I guess we call it a half mask. That's a full mask. So yeah, it's maybe about 50-50. Um, I was reading the newspaper about masks and what people thought about it in Macau, and a lot of half about half thought that you know why why were we even wearing them anyways? You know, 90% of the people got COVID wearing masks when they um, when they let when they let people come back into Macau, they let foreigners back in. The foreigners were banned for three years, so when they were um, able to come back um, and they lifted all the restrictions, like 90% got COVID right away, even though they all had masks kind of everywhere. So there was, so half people felt like that, like that it was, um, you know, that it's useless. And then the other half, um, some of them kind of thought that either A, um, they were kind of scared because they thought they could get COVID if they, if they took the mask off, <laughs> which is kind of funny because scientifically there isn't any evidence like that. You know, because um, basically here, they, you know, they, they required to wear a mask even when we're in public or running or jogging, walking dogs, which doesn't make any sense. But um, somehow the education of it with the decision makers was kind of messed up. So they didn't really understand how the COVID really worked. So anyways, we were kind of taking a look around for a mask. So yeah, so when they actually lifted it, um, even though 90% had COVID, they were afraid that they could get COVID right away um, once it was lifted. And then a lot of people, another part, also said that they were so used to wearing masks. So I, I see people like that too. They said, well, I have all these masks and I, since I have them, I, ha I have to wear them. Which is also funny too. I think it's funny that you have to wear it just because you have them. So they said, well, once I go through my box of 100 or whatever that I got left, which is another 100 days of wearing masks. But anyways, um, but I'd say probably at least like half are probably not wearing any mask at all. And I think we'll probably end up closing this in a moment. And we're just about at the end of our own. Um, I'm not going to go any further than this. So let's just go down to this little circle and just take a look at what we got in. And then we'll close it. So, so I think we were going to probably say is maybe like 60% without mask and 40% with mask, I would say, based on the sampling in the Venetian casino. And with that, we're going to um, go through these little crowd of people, kind of see. Looks like we have five, six, Maybe, maybe about 75% had no mask. Um, these three have no mask, but the older gentleman, woman, man does. These two have masks. It'd be interesting to interview them. Let's see what they all say. But anyways, that's Venetian. And this is just kind of a little sample of mask wearing and not, not wearing masking mask.
This is a crowd of people. We're gonna walk right through the middle and we can get a sampling of those two. Most of them have masks on. So, okay. Here's a couple one weird and one out. Okay, so that's um, a little sampling. No, uh, no gondola today. And we're gonna end it right there. Hey, check it out Macau 2023. Check out some more streets. Yeah.